blockage, a growth in the nose. blockage which makes it difficult for him to breathe for seven years man of God is walking towards the boy he lays his hand on the boy's nose man of God is praying for him breathe in and breathe out amen breathe in again breathe in again Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Man of God is praying for him, flipping his fingers on the boy's face, tapping his face and his nose. Man of God is still praying. And Do you know what God is doing? God is breaking the curse of touch. Amen. The tumor in the nose is clearing off. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Boy, God is healing you already. Amen. Jesus. Amen. Amen. Watch your screen. The boy is God has healed this boy already. Amen. Yes. You need to hear this. This is a special miracle. This small boy has been having NASA blockage of this wife. He cannot be able to breathe with pains. But after your short prayer, the sister can confirm that she cannot breathe freely without any pain. Tell, I wanted to tell us exactly what is happening to your, your it's your brother. Yes, tell us exactly what was happening to her. He, he has difficulty in breathing. It comes and goes like to grow. And when it grows, he cannot be able to breathe in the night. He will struggle. And when he struggle, he will sweat. And that sweat makes him me. Oh my so God. And you came to, with that condition. Now, how have you checked your, your boy? You can breathe well now. Baby, how do you feel now? Breathe in, breathe out. Any blockage on the nose? No. What is this? Tuberculosis? You have tuberculosis for how long? You have tuberculosis and glycoma in both eyes. The man in question has tuberculosis and partial glaucoma in both eyes. He's there to pray for him. The man is waiting patiently for the Spirit of God to work on him. The man has touched the man of God. The man of God blew oh, some air into his Amen. Yes, Amen. If you can touch me with his two finger. Yes. Yes, <laughs> People don't understand. You touch me and your eyes got open. Eh? You touch me and all the symptoms of tobacco is cleared off. Come on, give Jesus a big hand. Now I want us to check the tobacco. Run and check it. I'm run and come back and say, do what you couldn't do before. Woo. I am proud to be okay. in the covenant. I am proud to be in the covenant. Lord of covenant has visited me. Oh, he has given me a testimony. Yeah. 
did you did you observe what he was doing when he ran she did britain and britain he, do you know what yes i want to breathe yeah as i was breathing thinking that it should be like before yes. but that's something, that's something, something yes. different, something different. <laughs> then she you were looking at him you you immediately because of the run I saw you looking at it looking at it and he was doing like he, he said he thought that what usually happened to him if he takes a quick walk and run it will start and nothing like that so your breathing was free your air track was free no more tuberculosis symptom and you can see me clearly now can you see my finger you can see my finger you can see all my finger and you say he even read he read something how long was he having to uh, glycoma of the eyes 11 years Woo! i am proud to be in the covenant i am proud to be in the covenant Lord your landlord to be healed and God healed of glycoma and tuberculosis come and give Jesus a big hand go and go and bring more sick people on Sunday next Sunday go and bring more sick people go and discharge them from the hospital the God who heals heals freely Yes. in the days of thy power my people shall be willing can you shout a big amen come and see what a Lord has done for me, for my sin. on the floor has issues of having sexual intercourse in the dream he came for deliverance the man of God just prayed for him congratulations you're free the, floor. the lady in question has sexual intercourse in the dream she doesn't know why and she be, she's believing that she will get her deliverance today. Come out of her. Come out of her. In Jesus' name. It's going out. It's going out. It's going out. It's going out. In Jesus. It's going out. It's going out. It's going out. Thank you, Jesus. It's going out. You don't know what happened when you have strange sexual intercourse in the dream. They exchange your destiny. There's what we call wet dream. Wet dream is because of emotional attachment it come in and out it's not very frequent you don't you don't have problem with that one you don't have problem but when it become a regular a kind of a visit of a regular basis then your destiny is in trouble 
What did you feel? I feel something vibrate out of my body. Left. That man has gone out of you. Amen. Lift up your two hands. The wedding that joined you together with that strange man. I take it away from you. Amen. So that in this world you will enjoy life. In Jesus name. Amen. Sister, how has life been with you since all these years this thing has, has happened to you? Oh, her life has been miserable. Yes. Yeah, that's why you need to be prayed for. And that's why you need to get different. She's even married. No children she, for three years. Their husband and wife, sir. Their husband and wife. This will have spiritual husband. This will have spiritual wife. The devil is a bastard. See, the devil wanted to ruin their life. Listen to me. There are people who are suffering like this everywhere. There are some of you here. That is having your problem too. That's why your life won't go ahead. Miscarriages. Miss, you know, difficulty in getting married. And when you get married, difficulty in having children. Even when you have children, it's difficult in hardship, obstacle, sickness, disease. Your husband will be suffering these difficulties. Kneel down and join your that spiritual marriage you have and you have today that marriage is cancelled 